Hey man, what's up, y'all? What's up, y'all? Say, man, I know a lot of y'all knew I was gonna uh, make this video today, and y'all probably already know what it's about. Okay, basically, Cameron and Mace, who I love, they got a talk show, a sports talk show called it is what it is for y'all people that don't know. And they were commenting on a boxer named Shakur Stevenson, who was a born boxer. Well, they kind of had a back and forth online. Next thing you know, I wake up this morning and Jay Prince then made a comment and tagged Cameron and Mace and said that they were haters, called them haters. And on top of that, told them that he's that he's taking all these fades. He's catching all these fades and taking all bets. So Mace got on there and made a long ass speech talking about a nigga trying to be a 60 year old street nigga. We not your little niggas. We don't pay other niggas to do shit. Um, we don't pay other niggas to do shit. You got to put in your own world. Woo, 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 woo. Okay, first of all, I'm going to say I'm not biased. I'm from Houston, but I'm not biased. I love Cameron. Everybody know I jammed the shit out of Cam. But, Cam, let's face facts, Cam. You talking shit, bro, but you the scariest nigga in Dipset. All them fights you had, all the fights Dipset had back in the day, and if you look on YouTube, you didn't run to now one of them. Jim Jones was the only one steady fighting and getting jumped all the time. You you sitting there acting like you can't jump over barriers and barricades and shit at the Rucker Park tournament and shit. Man, come on, bro. Go on, on, Cam. You know you ain't about that shit. Okay, now, Mace, you saying Prince is trying to be a 60-year-old street nigga. First of all, I don't, I don't know how you motherfuckers don't know J. Prince history, but his arm reaches longer than a lot of niggas with more money than him, which you two niggas don't got more money than Jay. Check this out. We done seen what that man can do. This man got soldiers all around the United States, and this ain't dick riding or none of that shit there. I'm just speaking real facts. Now, all I seen was a nigga trying to be real to his client because he's Shakur, Shakur Stevenson's manager. He's not trying to be no street nigga. He already did his street shit when I was a little boy. I heard about Jay when I was a little boy, and this nigga was riding Rolls Royces and shit before you niggas even had $1,000, nigga. So y'all need to go on with all that bullshit.